Hello everyone, I am Sikandar Abu Rakib. Please welcome to my tutorial. Today I am going to create Node.js authentication app. Here I am using Passport.js and Passport.js is authentication middleware for Node.js. Here if we go to the documentation, you can see how to use the Passport.js. If I go to the authentication, if we see here, there is a routing and here Passport.authenticate middleware is using and if it is forward successfully, it will redirect to the proper page here is the authentication system we will use it within our route and here is the documentation about the configuration the passport into our app so we are going to use it and we are going to use the passport local there are some other strategies that we can follow into our application but here we are using local strategy so into local strategy we will configure our app accordingly and we will put the passport authentication middleware into our route and here we are using flash message so we are going to use connect flash and we are going to use bcrypt node.js also into our project so this is all about the introduction so i am going to start my project here i have created one project folder node auth pass local and i am going to create some files here touch server dot js and now i'm going to create the package dot json file by using npm init command node js app authentication app ng point server dot js sikandar yes okay and here i opened visual studio code as a code editor and i open my project folder here is the server file and here is the package.json file so i'm going to edit here dependencies so i'm going to install express and express session and then i'm going to install body parser and key parser then i'm going to install connect flash and morgan and mongos and be creep node.js now i am going to install passport and passport local okay i'm going to check okay i'm going to save it and i am going to create some folder and files quickly models and routes okay and I'm going to config and I'm going to create database.js and I'm going to create passport.js and now I'm going to models and creating user.js file and going out from this folder and again going to routes and creating another file called routes.js and coming back to main folder okay okay i'm checking the files models user okay now i'm going to server.js file and writing code here uh, i'm writing var express some dependencies of the app modules var express is equal to require express app express var morgan is equal to require morgan body parser require body parser okay and here var mongos require mongos and var flash to require flash var cookie parser require cookie parser and then var session is equal to require express session then var passport require passport and 
also var config require config database and var port is equal to process env dot port 3000 now i am going to database before that i am saving it and i am going to database and here i am writing module exports db equal to mongodb local host 27017 port number and the collection name will be like users and going to save it and coming back to server file now i can write mongoose uh, dot connect and config dot ybd oh i mistake the spelling db saving it db and use mongo client true okay saving it and now i'm going to connect the passport dot js file by using a require config passport okay now i am going to write some middlewares app dot use uh, i am writing down body parser dot json and body parser dot url encode it extend it true then cookie parser morgan for deb and secret equal to secret two three and save uninitialized true and resave true okay and passport dot initialize and app dot use passport dot session okay also i need to write use flash and here i need for routing file require routes routes and we will pass the app and passport to the route file and then last of all we can start the server by listening it app listen and our port number okay and saving it now i am going to user.js file and i am writing here var mongoose is equal to require mongoose and also var bcrypt is equal to require bcrypt dash node js and also var user schema equal to mongoose dot schema and within this method we can write one field is email type string and unique true and another field will be password type will be string okay and now i'll write user schema dot method dot generate hash anonymous function return bcrypt dot 
hash sync method and we will pass the parameter here the password and here also first parameter password and second parameter bcrypt gen salt sync 8 and third parameter is null okay and another method i am going to write is valid password and here also i am passing the password as a parameter and here i will write compare sync method and first parameter is password and second parameter is this password okay and last of all i will have to write module export mongoose dot model and it will be user and it will be user schema and i'm going to save it okay now i'm going to passport.js file i am in the official website of passport.js passport.js.org so for the local strategy i'm going to copy it and paste it here local strategy require passport local and strategy and again i am calling the user model here word user is equal to require models user okay then module exports is equal to anonymous function and passing passport as a parameter and saving it i am going back to here then i need to serialize user and i need to use this to block of quotes i'm copying entire so passport serialize user passing user and done organizing the code a bit and this is the method done method and equally here for deserialize user i'm passing the id and done parameter and here user find by id and id and function error and user and here the done method with error and user parameter okay i'm going to save it then i i will go to write a login strategy i'm going to here this is the way of writing the strategy okay i'm going to copy it and paste it here okay indenting a bit modifying here local login or only login and new local strategy before the function the user name field email and password field password and pass request to callback true okay and here my username will be email request also password and done and here will be email email and error user if error return done okay and if not user return done null false and message here i will work a bit request flash login message okay login message incorrect username and then for valid password null false and copying this 
and changing the password okay and then return to null user okay I'm going to save it okay now I am going to copy this code and paste it here and I am naming it as register okay and new local strategy I will have to modify a bit this section of code okay true then required email password done and find one email email error function okay then if error return done okay and the user is there then return done and here will be register message and I can write email is already taken okay and then I can write else var new user is equal to new user and new user dot email email and new user dot password is equal to a new user dot generate hash and password new user dot generate hash okay now new user dot save and anonymous function error and if error through error otherwise return done null and new user okay I need to cut it paste it here okay I don't need this one and also I don't need this one I'm going to save it okay so these are the two strategies